The Anti-Drugs Agency in Katana has also made some significant seizures of drugs and other harmful substances to curtail its abuse. It is alarming that 1,310.3184 kilograms of drugs were seized, out of which 1,294.131 kilograms was cannabis sativa. The anti-drugs agency succeeded in confiscating 16.1874 kilograms of psychotropic substances and 105 liters of codeine. This is a day set aside for us to review our efforts in drug war, strengthen our activities and cooperation in achieving a world free of drug abuse. While in the same vein, about 388 substance use dependency and users, personal users, has been cancelled and have been within the same period. Worried by the situation, the state government has inaugurated a drugs abuse control committee to intervene and reduce drugs abuse to the barest minimum. The government has also devised another means of checking the increasing spate of drugs abuse by partnering NGOs human rights and civil society organizations. Drug war was dangerous and uh, was more dangerous than wars against insurgency and banditry because it targeted three generations for destruction. The past generation, the present and the future. And as such, the three generations must buckle their armor to fight drug abuse and illicit drug use. Other stakeholders are looking at creating awareness among people, especially youth, religious and community-based organizations on the dangers of drug abuse. Uh, the department also over the years carries several sensitization lecture and enlightenment campaign, all with a view to uh, ensuring that the proliferation of drug is brought to a halt. However, observers identify shortage of manpower, working gadgets, inadequate operational vehicles, and inadequate funding as some factors hindering the successful fight against drug abuse and illicit trafficking in Nigeria. Abdullahi Ismail Amadi, Trust Television News, Katana.